I wanted to try to put something together which started with uh, a, quite a fragile, exposed acoustic guitar playing in sort of style of uh, a poor man's bure by Park, that sort of aspect. As far as the instrumentation goes, there are going to be a, 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 there's recorders to the early part which gives it a sort of slightly medieval feel. There's a lady who shows All that glitters is gold And she's buying a stairway to That was an idea of John Paul Jones is to put the recorders on. Um, and he played the recorders. When I actually had the idea for Stairway, I wasn't, that wasn't necessary, I wasn't thinking recorders. I was thinking more the texture of actually the electric piano. The idea of Stairway was to have uh, a, a, a piece of music, a composition, whereby it would just keep unfolding into more, uh, more layers and more moods and actually the whole intensity of the, or subtlety and the intensity the, 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 of the overlay of the composition would actually uh, accelerate as it went through on every level, every emotional level, every musical level. And so it just keeps opening up as, it's, as, it, as it continues through its sort of passage. Robert was magnificent with his input of lyrics to the music of Led Zeppelin anyway. This was during the period that we were at Headley Grange that uh, the, the, the thing was put together. It was slightly complicated to be doing this whole thing without a vocal because at the time there weren't any lyrics and this, is the, this was the backbone of what the song was, going, was intended to be. And, the, the whole of the running order from the beginning to the end was sort of mapped out. It was tricky, it was a tricky thing to do because there, there, there's a lot of music and changes in it. And it's that soon, if we all... I remember during that period, Robert was, he was sort of sitting down, leaning against the wall and he was just sort of writing. I, I, I won't never forget that image of him doing that. We do a run through of it from beginning to end with the uh, uh, guitar opening, as we all know. And then Robert comes up and starts to, he starts to pitch in and sing. And I tell you, he had to, it must have been 90% of the lyrics were, were already done. What I'd learnt about John Bonham, that he could be really effective if he came in somewhere down the line on the song. And so everything is starting to open up on this map, on this journey through. And all of this stuff was planned, you know, it wasn't just an accident or everyone chipping in. It was just, it, it, it really was a, a sort of design. One of the cardinal rules when I was a studio musician was that you didn't speed up. And I was keen to do something which had an acceleration to it, not only from the musical point of view, but from the lyricist, so that the whole thing would start to gain a momentum as it went through, so it wasn't just a monotone piece. And by that, I actually mean that it would, that, that it would subtly speed up, so you're breaking the number one cardinal rule. 
The concept of the solo was to have something like a sort of fanfare, so it's a definite transition. So it comes in with a, with a fanfare to introduce this solo, and the solo is just going to soar right through. It was a very inspired time for all of us at the time that we were living in the Headley Grange uh, as a residence, eating, sleeping, making music. That's what we were doing day after day after day. And it sort of tells when you hear the fourth album. But, you know, Stairway is a sort of byproduct of it, of, of all of that. But, you know, it's obviously been quite substantial in, uh, uh, as a milestone for Led Zeppelin. At the end of that solo, there's the trills, which lead it into this huge finale, which is the vocal as we wind, wind on down the road. By that point, it's really, it's, it's really motoring. It's not racing, but it, it's just the passion of it has just, has just unfolded on every respect of, of the, 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 the lyrical aspect of it. And Robert was inspired. It was really an inspired period of time. It sort of shows, that I think the lasting quality of this music over all these years is the fact that everyone's playing so honestly and uh, with such conviction that it sort of shows.